In Southern California, skimboarding is a sport on the rise and is quite possibly becoming one of the world's most inventive new sports. By the barrel of his desperation, but fear is a man with a gun in hand. Out of weapons, surrounding him, and the thrill that he'll get away with it, like he found it all, found it all. But I'm still here. Although skimboarding has spiked in popularity over the last decade, it is still far from a new sport. During these early days in Laguna Beach, lifeguards skimmed on wooden handmade boards far different than the ones we are used to today. Skimboarding is a completely unique sport, unlike any other. The first and possibly most difficult part to perfect is the one-step drop, in which you must break into a full sprint towards the water. Mid-sprint, you must drop the board onto the shallow water and take one last step before landing on the board. This technique can be frustrating and sometimes even painful. Next, you must make it out to the incoming wave with enough speed to cut the turn, a lot like how a surfer would. The final step, once you cut the turn, is to drop back into the wave and let your speed push you back up the beach. Orange County is known for several things. Beautiful homes, expensive cars, busy streets, and yes, skimboarding. Year round, skimboarders flock to the beaches all over the OC. Spots like Aliso Beach in Laguna have become famous because of the unique steepness of the beach and unmatchable shore break. The sometimes massive waves can be very dangerous and are a major concern for the lifeguards. On July 24, 2009, at the Wedge in Newport Beach, a 50-year-old bodyboarder was dropped onto the jetty by a 25-foot wave. Despite the lifeguards' best effort, they were unable to rescue him in time. This is a very powerful reminder of how dangerous the ocean can be. for about seven years. Uh, buddy just showed me a video and I really liked it and started doing it. You think? The sport's growing a lot. It's it crazy. Is. It's like, you know, you go from like seven years ago, there was like maybe like six people out yeah. ever. Now there's like, they're everywhere. Yeah. Know? My name's Kevin. I've been skimming for nine years, but only really doing like real skimming for three years so. It's something fun to do. I've 
been skimming for about like 10 years. And uh, what got me into it was uh, when I was in uh, Hawaii, I was seeing like a bunch of guys riding these boards, like old school style boards. Uh, I like this better than surfing because, you know, less shark attacks. And, uh, but you get a different feel for the ride. You're not dropping in, you're going at the wave, face to face. But yeah, I like skimboarding. I'm gonna stay with it. And I'll do a little surfing in the meantime, but I'm gonna stay skimming.